In this video, I will show you how to add signature in Outlook. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see on Outlook.com currently in my email. Now the first thing you're gonna to want to do is come up to the top left hand corner and press the new email button to create a new email message. From here, if you look at the toolbar at the top, you wanna to come over to the right hand side and you're gonna see this icon here for signatures. So you wanna go ahead to give this a click and then click on to signatures. So what that's gonna do is bring up a window like this and what we can do is start creating a new signature. So what you're gonna to want to do is press the green new signature button here and what you can do is give your signature a name so let's just call this one work and what you need to do is just enter your signature into here so what i've done is just added a basic signature and what you can do is adjust the text so you can change your color for example say we wanted to make it red i'm going to make it bold and just make this a little bit bigger just by selecting the font size down here and what you can also do is add links so you can see i've got a link here test.com of course this is not real this is just an example so to add the link, all you wanna do is highlight it, come down and press the insert link button here, and then choose where to direct that to. So I'm just gonna put test.com again into here and then press okay. If you want to, you can also add images. You can insert pictures using this button here. So once you've done that, what you're gonna to want to do is come down and press the green save button. So that's one signature added. Now we can add different signatures. So I can come up and add as many signatures as I want, just using the same process. What we can then do is select one of these as a default signature. So this work one I've created, if I wanted to set this as a default signature, what you can do is come down to this section here where it says select default signatures and then choose for new messages, click onto the drop down box and we can click onto work and then click save. Now what's gonna happen if I go ahead and just come back to my inbox, then what I'm gonna do is come up and press onto new email up in the top left hand corner and you will see by default our signature has now been added. So that is how to add signature in Outlook. With that being said, I hope this quick tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.